Struggling. Hello everyone. Uh, yes, welcome to space. Uh, you're probably wondering what we are doing in outer space. Um, it's a good question. We're actually not in outer space. If we were, you would probably see these little pieces floating around. However, uh, this is uh, an actual replica of Astro Bimo. And what Astro Bimo is, uh, is a MO that we believe is the first MO to be sent to the International Space Station and is currently orbiting the planet as we speak. And I believe all these little pieces are floating around. Actually, we have video of that, so they are in fact floating around. There's a small camera pointed at Astro Bimo. Um, so this was launched uh, as a project for a program called Quest for Space, which does uh, little experiments and things. Actually, they're not little, they're uh, pretty interesting experiments uh, for school kids to interact with. And this was a convenient way to put a computer interface up there and have some fun. So we were fortunate enough to have Nikki Yang help us out with this. Uh, she recorded some space relevant lines for us. Uh, Bima, why don't you give us a sample? That is probably a very good question. Um, I imagine um, there's one up there somewhere. What else can you say for us, Bimo? Why is everything floating around in here? Yes, I imagine up there everything is floating around. Down here, not so much. Um, this is one of my favorites right here. I'm sorry, Dave. I'm afraid I can't do that. Yeah. Um, kind of cool. How about, uh, how about something else, Bimo? Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer to I'm half crazy, all for the love of you. Cool. Can you call Jake and tell him I may be a little late to dinner tonight? Uh, yeah, you'll probably be a little late because it's going to be up there for a while while floating around. Oh, you won't be floating around. You're actually bolted to a little base. This is a replica of BMO's little containment unit, uh, so these little bit floaty bits won't disappear. Uh, BMO's screw down, so BMO won't disappear. Take that off for now. This is actually um, for Nikki. Uh, it's going to go hopefully on her desk. Little uh, commemorative plate, which will show the launch stats for Astro BMO. And the purpose of these little bits is one to show that we actually made it into orbit. And the little camera will be showing those flowing around. They uh, have a little challenge for BMO, and what BMO can do with the servo arms is try to whack them as they fly by. And you're probably wondering how BMO is going to whack these things. Well, out of pure luck, uh, it happens to be there's actually two electromagnets on the side, and these are magnetic, so um, we can issue a command to draw them to the side, and BMO can smack them there. There's also two laser diodes pointing straight down in front of each arm, and there are sensors underneath, so when an object passes over, BMO will get notification, and then can take a swipe at it, sending them bouncing around the little containment unit. Uh, pretty cool stuff. And if BMO gets really crazy, you could just go wild up there. That is going wild. This particular little unit has uh, some nice little space-related items, uh, since it will most likely be sitting on a desk somewhere, showing the world what the space station and uh, NASA's logo looks like, if you didn't know that. So to put Astro BMO into perspective, uh, size-wise, you can kind of see how big BMO really is, but this is regular size jumbo BMO um, with working buttons. No, I am not an iPad, are you? No, you're not an iPad. I get that asked a lot, so we threw that line in there to kind of shut people up. And this is BMO Boy, which is the handheld gaming unit for um, playing uh, retro games and such, and a couple of custom games. So you can kind of see the sizes here. Actually, BMO Boy came after Astro BMO. I was asked to build Astro BMO, and given the size constraints, this is what I came up with. But I just scaled this up, this up, to 
to create this and made that version. Um, they both here are running on Pi Zeros. Uh, the, the, the Astro Beamo up in space is running off a Pi Compute module, much more powerful than a Pi Zero, but I needed um, something that would fit inside that little box there. So there you have it. Um, the, this is the Mo family. You got your two terrestrial Mo's and Astro Beamo. We will have some videos and things of BMO doing some fun stuff in space. So in addition to displaying um, nice space art for the world, Astro BMO can give you little informational nuggets. Incoming transmission. And you'll either get a fun scientific fact or you'll get some science fiction quote from a movie. Um, that is a line from, I believe, Rocket Man. Uh, you don't want to raise your kids on Mars. It's cold as hell. So, let's put BMO back in the space element. Keep that atmosphere locked in there for you. Any final words for the uh, Earthlings, BMO? One small step for men, one giant leap for mankind. For more kind. Very nice. All your peace that belong to us. Alright folks, uh, see you in orbit.